STATE POLICE ARE CONTINUING TO INVESTIGATE ALLEGATIONS OF INSTITUTIONAL SEXUAL ASSAULT AT THE BELLWOOD ANTIS SCHOOL DISTRICT. THE TROOPERS THERE WERE AT THE SCHOOL TODAY, NOW WORKING TO DETERMINE IF ANY OTHER CHILDREN WERE VICTIMIZED BY THE MIDDLE SCHOOL WRESTLING COACH, RYAN BLAZIER. All this all stems from a story we first told you about last week. Blazier was arrested on Thursday, facing several sexual assault charges involving three children, two of which were on school property. Officers tell us they are committed to conducting a fair and thorough investigation and are encouraging anyone with information to come forward. Tonight, parents voiced questions and concerns to the Bellwood Anta School District about the state police investigation at a public meeting. Our David Kaplan was there. He joins us now live with what parents and the school board had to say tonight. David. Amanda, that's right. Parents asked questions and shared frustrations with the Bellwood Antis School Board at tonight's school board meeting for over an hour. The room was full of parents. Some were crying. Last Thursday, Ryan Blazier, assistant coach for the Bellwood Antis Middle School wrestling team, was arrested and charged by state police with raping an eight-year-old girl and sexually assaulting two boys on the wrestling team. The school board says... The school board says they were contacted by Child and Youth Services, or CYS, in December and told about the investigation. The school board says they put Blazier on a safety plan as recommended by CYS, taking away his keys, fob, and not allowing him to be alone with children. In January, the district then decided to suspend Blazier. Parents say Blazier should have been suspended earlier. He's a suspected molester. And you let him in his school. We have been told by the Pennsylvania State Police that there's an active investigation and that we cannot disclose certain things until the investigation is complete. And once the investigation is complete, then there will be full disclosure of everything. One parent says she asked her child today what the school told them and if counseling was being offered. Our kids didn't know anything. So nope. All they know is that they have questions. They don't understand what's going on. Um, you need to make a list of resources available from outside of this school. We offer counseling to the wrestlers. We offer My wrestlers our... haven't gotten counseling okay, offered well, to them. Let, let them answer. Oh, Sorry. We are, we are planning more counseling services. We have to have time to put things together. Superintendent McEnroy says the district is working on having counseling available to all children who need counseling in the district. Blazier will next face a preliminary hearing. He is currently in custody at the Blair County Prison. State Police Trooper Dunsmore was at the meeting. He is asking anyone with information on the charges of Blazier or information of another victim that has not yet come out to call State Police in Holidaysburg immediately. In Bellwood, Blair County, David Kaplan, WTAJ News.